Hi, today a quick look at this monstrosity I found this in a dumpster. Apparently, it is a very uh, damaged fluorescent light ballast. So, I am not sure what happened here, but you can see the case is completely melted over the uh, ballast themselves and caramelized even. It is really a luck it did not take fire. Uh, the case is quite big and has uh, venting holes, so it should have been able to cool properly, but obviously not. Uh, look at this mess. So my guess is that it was in a drop ceiling with uh, fiber uh, glass wool. And maybe uh, it did not allow it to uh, cool properly and after uh, extended uh, use uh, it finished like this but it could have uh, taken fire really I guess it was not far you can see this so I will open it Here is what we have. So what I will do probably, uh, these are just uh, like transformers so I can sell them at the scrapyard. So I will try to uh, clean the best I can them, remove uh, extra plastic on it and then I will uh, sell the transformers for scrap metal copper and also salvage the wires here. The Electrical uh, connectors here are good. Uh, you can see even the wires did melt here inside the plastic. Really, really, the first time I see something like this. Uh, big, big mess. And a lot of luck, I believe. It did not uh, put fire to a building. And you know what? I have actually two of them. Same deal here, exactly same condition. So, same uh, glass wool glued on the bottom. So, the bottom of the case obviously did melt even more because it is completely uh, stuck to the transformers. And, uh, all the plastic is very brittle and crusty. Quite uh, something. Ah, and even the uh, terminals here are crusty and they just break. We had uh, a screw securing these transformers. But now it is not uh, really useful anymore because they are secured with uh, melted plastic. So, this, uh, I guess. Uh, is a terrible uh, failure. Not sure if it is a failure of, of the design of the thing or if it is just an installation failure, but really something you do not want to see. There is no, I do not find any uh, uh, manufacturing date, so I can tell if it, is, it seems quite old. Obviously, maybe from the 80s and or 90s, something like this. It does not seem to be a really modern equipment, but still, it is something you want to not see, or they do not want to see them anymore. So it will go in the recycling. So thanks for watching. Bye bye.